June 18th. Two weeks they will wait for a spare wood box in which to bury their moldering dead. For a price, the collaborators. So named anyone who survives too well or too long. We'll add the corpses to the mass graves whose trenches line the city like upside down fortress walls. And which horror is worse? They do not know, but they cannot pay the price anyway. So they lay their beloveds on scraps of wood and metal and stone and wrap them as they may against all comers who eat the dead, insects and birds and stray dogs and already honeycombing memory. Two weeks and they can make a last bed, two weeks. But their tongues, their nostrils, their lungs, their hearts will always stink of this absence.